how to use the law of attraction to improve your appearance, to look hot, to lose weight. Yeah, yes, believe it, it can be done. And if it can be done, you can do it too. This is Lori, your positivity princess, bringing you all things happy and positive. People use the law of attraction to do so many things. If you aren't sure what the law of attraction is, watch this simple video here, or even look in the link below, but be sure to watch this one first for all the juicy information. So you've heard stories of people using the law of attraction to attract wealth and abundance, love and relationships, better friendships, beautiful homes and cars and even beauty, yeah. Well, I ask you, do you think you can use the law of attraction to look hotter or more attractive? The answer is yes, of course you can. Absolutely, 100%, keep watching. What steps can you take to look way healthier, younger, and in general hotter? I actually have put together eight methods that I've studied and assembled just for you. So each method also includes a tool that you can use immediately so that you can start getting results. So implementing a strategy or method for 21 days is ideal because that's what develops a habit, but even just a few days will make a difference. The tools I mentioned are either a meditation, a worksheet, or just some kind of exercise, some kind of action-based exercise. Either way, it will be a benefit to you to participate as actively and fully as possible. So if you wanna look hot, pay attention. I want you to have everything you ever wanted, even if it seems impossible. Every version of you exists already. You just have to know which one you want to embody. Think of it like this. When you think of famous celebrities, there are so many versions of each one that you can call to mind. So let's try it out. Okay, so I'll say a celebrity and then you picture them in your mind and then I will show you a few versions of them and see if any of them match with what you were thinking of. Okay, the first one, Jennifer Lopez. Okay, so here she is with no makeup. Here she is casual. Here she is wearing a fancy gown, probably at a gala or event. These are all past and present versions of her and they all exist, as well as an infinite number of other versions of her as well. So one more example, okay, and this one's a male, uh, Christian Bale. So bring up a picture of him to your mind. Now think of him from the Batman films, here we are. This one's my favorite, okay. So also there's Christian Bale from The Machinist, and then there's one here from American Hustle. So this man only needs to see himself in a different way and he actually becomes that new role. He's really famous for this. So you can see all the different versions of both of these actors. So you can do the same thing. You can bring about a totally different version of yourself. An infinite number of versions of you exists too. There's an ideal version of you that you can access and attract. Disclaimer, and listen closely. When I say the best or hottest version of you, I do not mean the version of you that looks the most like society's ideal version of what is good looking. Make sure you are being true to your own unique appearance and your own qualities and characteristics and style. Last thing before the nitty gritty, I have time stamped each method so that you can scroll to the part of the video that interests you or that resonates with you. Save this video as you will more than likely need to come back and take a look at it again for the exact methods. Okay, so we know that it is possible to change our appearance. Let's look at the how. Okay, the methods. I'll present three methods in total right now. Okay, method number one. This starts with self-love, okay? So we're gonna call it start with self-love. You have to start by loving yourself and everything about your appearance. Do this, okay? Look into the mirror, list every part of you that you can see and say how grateful you are for that part. It is okay to desire adjustment of a particular feature, although first you must accept the appearance that God gave you. Accept the appearance that you were born with. Show yourself love and compassion as you do deserve it. There's nothing wrong with the way you look. While you do this, feel as good and confident as possible. Do this every time you pass a mirror. If you catch yourself being unkind to yourself, correct yourself immediately with a kind statement. My mom would always say, if you have nothing nice to say, don't say anything at all. And the same goes for yourself. Part of loving yourself is dealing with and accepting your shadow self. The shadow self is the side of you that you are not aware of. The personified version of your subconscious that holds all of those defense mechanisms and limiting beliefs about yourself. If you'd like to know more about the shadow self, there's a wonderful video by someone called the Gem Goddess. She explains the shadow self very well, and I put a link down in the description below. 
Some common limiting beliefs that people have about their appearance include, number one, I cannot lose weight. I have a slow metabolism. Number two, everyone in my family is plain or overweight. Number three, I am not good at doing my makeup or hair. Number four, I have no fashion sense. I hear people say this all the time. Number five, I'm average looking. Number six, I am not attractive, so I make up for it by being smart. Okay, so summary, you have to love yourself, use the mirror method and squash these limiting beliefs. I have a really good worksheet that I've attached to my blog and the link for that is in the description below, so take a look. Method number two, know what you want. This is really important. If you know you want to look different but you don't know in what way, then you need to go back to step number one. Work on loving yourself. Change should be for a point, like for improvement or for increased happiness or self-confidence not just for the sake of change or you know, to address boredom. That's not a good reason to change. Okay, otherwise map out what you want to look like. I've created a couple of tools for you to use in order to really figure out what you wanna look like. If you do use my tools, please let me know um, how it works for you. I'm really interested to see your success stories. There are links to my blog in the description below for all the tools that I've mentioned. Method number three, the time-lapse gratitude method. This method is my favorite for manifesting change quickly. It was created by Andrew Kapp, the author of The Last Law of Attraction book that you will ever need to read. He also has a YouTube channel, it's brand new, and it's all about the law of attraction. It's really awesome, take a look. The link is in the description. I adapted this method a little to suit our needs, but it's essentially the same. Okay, so this method involves making three separate gratitude lists. The titles of these lists include past appearance, current appearance, future appearance. You will write three to five items on each list. For past appearance, you will write three things like this. I'm so happy and grateful for, and then you will fill in the appearance related item that you're grateful for from your past. I find this one very easy as your past self is younger and often what is being sought after, a more youthful appearance. So have fun with this. What are you grateful for from your younger self? Then in the list titled current self, write three things that you're grateful for with regard to your appearance. And then for future self, you write, I am so happy and grateful. And here's where you write the appearance items that you desire to manifest. The next step, and this is important, is to take all of these items and mix them all up past, present and future. What I like to do is have them all written up and then cut it into little strips of paper. Then I can pull them out one at a time. So I can say, I'm so happy and grateful for my beautiful green eyes. I'm so happy and grateful. Well, I put, I love my teeth, but I'm so happy and grateful for my nice straight white teeth. So why does it work? It allows you to feel that same gratitude for attributes that already exist and attributes that you are attracting to you. Gratitude lets you have the feeling of already having the trait that you desire. It's similar to living in the end, as Neville Goddard says. Andrew Cap made this into an easy to use method for easy conjuring of the right emotions and gratitude. So see the link below to my blog that leads you to the printable worksheet that you can use for easily manifesting using this time-lapsing method, okay? Check that out, dude, and dudettes. Okay guys, sorry about this, but I cannot publish a video about looking your best without adding a simple concept of having positive habits. By this, of course, I mean to drink water, eat a balanced, healthy diet, obviously and you do not have to go all the way vegan, but unprocessed and natural or organic is always better. Less chemicals is better. Get lots of rest and physical exercise and remember to be mindful and meditate. Very powerful exercises, all of those. Okay, now put down your phone and go get started. Start getting hot, start right now. Comment below which method you are going to try first. I'm super excited to see your results. For more videos, click the link and subscribe. There is scientific evidence that watching any of my videos actually makes you hotter immediately, okay? I'll, I'll post, the, post the link to that. Uh... Okay, I might have made that up, but at least it made you smile, and when you smile, you look more gorgeous to me. I have a course coming out soon that will be all about manifesting the ideal version of yourself. I will keep you posted on that. Okay, thanks guys. Have a great day. I love you all, all you hotties out there, and A, be positive. Mwah, love you. <laughs> How to use the law of attraction to approve. <sighs> well, I actually have put together, save this video so that you will 
more than likely um, get rest, physical activity. Okay, so I cannot save this video as you were. Oh my god, I have a really good worksheet below that you can use. Uh, show myself. Okay, I cannot lose weight. You will write three to five items for each 